All right, folks. Welcome, welcome. Glad you're here. Let's jump right in and start warming up. Here we go. Nine, 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 nine. Nine, nine. taller nine 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 it's okay to slide up to it nine 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 back down Let's mix it up a little bit. No, oh, sing. No, 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 little accents. No. Okay, all good. Give us a pitch. No. Good to see you. A few of you have checked in. Bless you for doing that. I know that someone's out there breathing, living, and with us. So, great. Let me pray for us. Lord, thank you for this time together, uh, although virtually, and to know, Lord, um, the joy that is ours to sing for you. Uh, be blessed, I pray, Lord, by our, by our work, and use it uh, for your glory. Lord, we're, we're missing being together, and I pray you give us wisdom to know how to do that safely and wisely. So thank you, Lord, for what uh, you're going to do through us, even using this time, Lord, uh, to keep our voices in good shape. And we love you and pray in Christ. Amen. Let me address that uh, just as I was praying there and been thinking about this. Um, not sure when we'll be able to come back together as a choir. I want that to be really soon, but I also love you and want to protect you. And so um, probably soon we'll, we'll look at some new music the music that we're working on, I do intend to use on Sunday mornings. So it's not for naught. Um, and we'll try to look at some new things here coming up before too long. Probably take a little bit of a break part of the summer, but not all. One of the things, folks, that we really need to do is we must sing. If we go weeks and weeks and weeks without singing, it's not going to be good for us vocally. And even relationally, uh, we need to be together. So... Um, We'll do, uh, my plan is to do a Zoom meeting tomorrow night. I'll send you an invitation tomorrow if you can join us. Just 30 minutes just to peek in and connect. Uh, anyway, look for that tomorrow. So first thing up tonight, according to your order that I sent you, is Easter song. Let's just uh, try to kind of go through this, um, at least part of it. Let's start right at the beginning. Give us an intro, Amy. Uh, lots of energy. You ready? One, two, three, here. Hear the bells ringing, they're singing that we can be born again. More consonants, the more energy go. And da. Hear the bells ringing, they're singing Christ is risen from the dead. Here's our slurps. The angel upon the tombstone said he is risen just as he said. Christ is no longer dead. Jesus Christ is no longer dead. Off and Joy nice. to 
nicely done, right? I want to go back to the beginning for just a second. And by the way, let's weigh in if you can hear enough of all the folks. So just kind of weigh in for your own section, and we'll do a bit of a tweak, okay, if we need to. All right, let's go back to the beginning. Um, here's what, uh, here the bells ring. There's two ways to sing this. Well, there are a hundred ways, I guess, but hear the bells ringing, they're singing that we can be born again. Those are correct rhythms and notes, but not at all what we're trying to, to sing. Hear the bells ringing, they're singing that we can be born again. It's totally different. Let's try that a cappella all together. Thank you for correcting that pitch a bit. One, two, three, go. Hear the bells ringing, they're singing that we can be born again. No slurping. Yep, ba, ba. Hear the bells ringing, they're singing Christ is risen from the dead. Yeah. Yeah, and the more energy we can get from that, I hear a little bit more energy from our lady friends over here than our guy friends over here. So, hear the bells ringing, they're singing. Try that, go. Hear, hear the, the bells, bells ringing, they're singing that we can be born again. Yeah, that's different. Bravo, guys. Just that little bit of tweak. Oh, it's awesome. Very good. Okay, that's all we need on that. We've got a lot to do tonight, so we're moving quickly. Thy will... Okay, let's start back at the beginning. We haven't started at the beginning in a little bit, so our cup was filled with darkness. Uh, go ahead and start at the very beginning, I think, to set the context. Nice and dark. Yeah. All in. Here we go. And our cup was crescendo with darkness. Filled with death, Christ took our cup and drank it, and gave us life, and gave us hope, gave us Himself. Let's do some some pitches. Bass, yet not my will for the basses. Now, one of the things, note the contrast. If you look at the top of the page, there are all of these phrase marks. My father let this cup. So nice and flowing and smooth, but when we get to yet not to my will, all of those are gone. And we have uh, added in accent marks. So not... Yet not my will, O oh Lord, yet not my, yet not my will, O oh Lord, yet not my will. Lots of consonants, <laughs> punchy, punchy. So just the guys right there, three, and I'll just let them sing. Yet not my will, O oh Lord, yet not my will, O oh And yet not to my get really after that. Girls, will you try that? Okay, let's try that all together. Um, and yet not to my Yet not, yet not my will, O oh Lord, yet not my will. So the second will bass, that's tricky, it's lower than the first one. Let's try it together one more time. I'm still hoping for a little bit more energy. And yet not my will, O oh Lord, yet not my will, O oh Lord. Easy. But Wait for that. Alto 
before but girls you have a tricky part because you're moving at different times uh, remember no vibrato on all that just kind of a uh, kind of a drone sound there if you will um, bum, bum. and then look at let's uh, Amy play the the bottom line of page four there this is the girls part so a uh, lady sing along ready and then soprano right and they <laughs> they have to breathe sometime you'll be covering for each other right so sopranos you just have to stay on that weird sounding note bravo and if we're sticking on the note bravo brenda get that odd sounding c sharp play the b flat to c sharp distance all right is anybody still up there could use a little bit more bass. Philip, why don't you run in and get the iPad out of the choir room real quick? I meant to bring that out. It's on the, you know where it is? Okay. All right, we'll get a little bit more bass in there. Okay, so, and then on page five, we have exactly the same thing we had before. Nothing changes. Look at page six. Sopranos and tenors, I'm not going to make you sing that right now, but here's what happens with the basses and the altos. We walk up, mom, while the tenors and sopranos just stay up here. Let's just save the voices and practice the bass tenor, uh, excuse me, bass alto line that walks up and go. Then they took our Samuel accent and nailed him to a tree. And then they broke his body, poured out his life, put him to death. Okay, so the alto and the, and the bass are in unison right there. And right there at the top of page seven, Amy, play the tenor and the soprano part right there, please. Okay, does that make sense? Let's try it right there. We're at the top of page seven. All the parts are together, okay? Here's our pitch. And... Lord, Let's just review that a bit for a second. Look on page seven, go back one second. This time, again, there are no phrase marks. All the other times this part happens, it was connected in legato, but my father let the urgency, the sense of urgency, this uh, the third plea, uh, Lord, please, if it be your will, let this cup pass from me. So there's exasperation, anguish. I mean, he sweat great drops of blood. And so we want to try to capture that with the energy of the sound, consonants, the accents, okay? And then it, you hear the resolve at the end, it's just peaceful acceptance. Um, 
And so uh, altos and basses, you just kind of walk down at different ways. Play the alto part on, play the soprano, ba, fine, be done. Play the soprano on page eight. And then now just play alto. We're gonna speed up just to save time. Be done, thy will be done. Alto as you get your low notes. Okay. Here is the bass part right there. <clears throat> the bass. Thy will be done. Thy will be done. Philip's got the D. Don or this one. I don't really have that low D. <laughs> Thank you, Philip. You can sing the A. I'd rather you sing the D up higher. Play that that, that skip, Amy. Will be done. We could have maybe a few sing that A, but really the D's need to be primary there, okay? Tenors, you walk up. Thy will be done, thy will be done. So nothing crazy there for you, okay? Let's keep moving. At the name of Jesus. At the name of Jesus, okay? Um, let's, uh, let's go with page four. Uh, girls, this is just, let that just emote. Okay, here we go. Here's our pitch. Girls, and sing. Girls only. Quarter rest. Right, bravo, ladies. And we're making a quarter rest. Uh, in the middle of page four, we're not doing the dotted quarter that's written. So make a quarter rest. I'll try to show that clearly. That's the idea. Guys, uh, sing with us. The guys part on the beat. And when, guys, when you come in, just you're sneaking into the sound of the girls, right? They had this big kind of a moting line, and then it came right back down, so we sneak in with him, and, be, and then boom, we're going. Ready? And he came obedient unto death, Rest. even death on the cross. And what we have there that I didn't show you very well there is a crescendo, right? So let's start with the girls. And became middle four one. And became obedient unto death. Rest and even death on the cross. Keep going. pitch because we've already modulated it over. Okay? So, and in earth. Please don't just sing, and in earth. Um, I don't know. I think of this as like a trampoline kind of, and in earth, and in. So it's got some weight. It's got some bounce into it. It's not just, and in earth, and in earth. 
and then get us to the modulation. <laughs> that every knee shall bow, not just that every knee shall bow. That's lovely enough, but it, it misses some of the energy of that. Um, let's start at the top of seven. So there, there's our pitch, nice and punchy, and now one. Keep accenting. And every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Keep that same accent. Try not to hold it more than you can do in, in a breath. All right. Hopefully the balance is pretty good. Bravo. Keep going. He was wounded. We haven't looked at this uh, much. Let's just look at the beginning part of it. Um, he was wounded. Just uh, let's rest our voices a minute. Will you play just the girl's part right there at the beginning? Um. Actually, sing it a little bit slower. The rest. Comes the crescendo. Okay, that was what the girl uh, uh, parts sounded like. Here are the guys. Their parts right here, he was wounded. Three and. show you exactly where that is. Nicely done. We got to rest our voices just a minute. Let's go back. Smidge slower. Uh, he was woo. Yum, pum, pum. Really let that settle in and feel a little bit of that anguish on he was wounded. Okay, here's our pitches again. Three and. He was wounded for our trust. Breathe. Go for crescendo. Breathe. Crescendo. Breathe. Slowing down. One. 
Play the bass part, I know, and when there's wounds, we are. It's a pretty low bass. Uh, try to keep it in there. All right. How cool. Dallas Westbear watching live from Florida. Wish he, he was here to sing. Wish you were too, brother. Awesome. That makes my night. Okay, so just kind of a quick review of that. What a powerful song. Oh, about the suffering of our Lord. Um, let's keep moving. Christ is risen. Oh, man, how can we do this in 10 minutes? What was I thinking when I chose six? What is that? Seven. Yeah, seven. Okay, anyway, uh, we've done this a bunch, uh, so I'm not too worried about it. Let's do this. Go to page six. This is that little. Let's just do practice the girls part here at six. It's, here's the girls. Play Miss Amy. Christ is risen, shout your And they're out, okay? Let's go with the guys. Christ is risen. Guys, heroically, too, and then girls, easy. Christ, Christ is risen, sing hallelujah, celebrate this day of days. Out. Christ is risen, shout your praises. into Easter song, right? Okay, so you should have that marked, right? Top of page 10, there's a cut that goes straight to measure five of Easter song. Bravo, folks. Nicely done, team. Okay, uh, and can it be? Man, you're sounding good at home. Hey, I hope you're singing at home, and I want to reiterate, if you came in late into the rehearsal, as a choir, we've not sung in the same room for, I don't know, eight, nine weeks. We, our voices need to sing. You know, on Sunday mornings, I hope you're singing to the top of your lungs along uh, with, the, with the worship time. So anyway, uh, keep singing, keep singing, keep singing. All right. Um, just a smidge of this. Um, let's do the ending of this. Page 7, no condemnation. And we only do a second of this because we need to spend more minutes on Ain't No Rock. So... No condemnation now, my friend. Okay, with great confidence. You see that note at the bottom of the page? It says it, uh, well, it says it on every line. I'll write an editor that actually does that on every line, an open score. That doesn't usually happen. Usually the guys have to hunt for it on the top of the, uh, the soprano part. But anyway, here we go. No condemnation. Here we go, Eddie. Ah. No condemnation shall we die. And all in him is mine. Alive in him, my living hand. I'm clothed in righteous rest divine. Oh, yeah, did we just get the idea? And let's say divine. And clothed in righteousness divine. Okay? That's the idea on that one. It's just no condemnation now, I dread. Now, I dread. 
Jesus and all. Yes. Ah, that's a glorious moment. I think that's my favorite part in that. All right. Ain't no rock going to shout. All right, just review at the beginning. Give us in that, that first pitch, Amy, and the D. So, here comes the Lord riding on a donkey with people waving branches and calling him king. Here comes the Lord riding through Jerusalem. If the people don't shout, the rocks will cry out. That's the idea of that, okay? All right, here comes the Lord. Two, here we go, everybody. Here comes the Lord riding on a donkey with people waving branches and calling him king. Now, here comes the Lord riding through Jerusalem. If the people don't shout, the rocks will cry out. Here we go. Rocks keep silent. Jesus comes to set me free. Rocks keep silent. I'm going to shout the victory. Rocks keep silent. Jesus reigns in Ain't no rock gonna shout for me. Oh, that's gonna sound awesome. Can't wait for that. So, hey, please breathe at the bottom of page two. I'm gonna shout the victory. That space will create a lot of energy. Uh, plus, we get a breath. Uh, okay? So, I wonder if let's sing that a cappella. Okay, Philip, I know you're kind of reading this one, but. Uh, this one's a little tricky on the bottom, so I'm, go I'm gonna shout, that's an A, right? I'm gonna shout the victory. I'm gonna shout the victory. Remember bass, we're gonna clip that a little bit. Bum, ba, ba, bum, 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 Here we go, rocks keep silent. Player pitches. Acapella, two, three, uh. Rocks keep silent. Jesus comes to set me free. Rocks keep silent. I'm gonna shout the victory. Rocks keep silent. Jesus reigns in majesty. Ain't no rock gonna shout for me. That's that's the idea. Let's go back again. It's still a little bit too long on victory. Victory. Staccato there, please. Uh, we're making an eighth and an eighth rest, and it's actually a staccato eighth. Yeah, cha 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 right there. So here we go back again. Two, three. Rocks keep silent, Jesus comes to set me free. Rocks keep silent, I'm gonna shout the victory. Rocks keep silent, Jesus reigns in majesty. Ain't no rock gonna shout for me. Ever so slightly, we're not in agreement quite yet on the victory. Victory. Let's just say it together, okay? So, I'll model it first. I'm gonna shout the victory. Say it with me. Ready? I'm going to shout the victory. Now, we want to sing it exactly like you just said it. So here's our pitches. Don't go on. Don't go on. Two. Ready? I'm going to shout the victory. Oh, a little bit too long over here still somewhere. Uh, again, two. Very short. I'm going to shout the victory. Yes. Okay, yes. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. Nice and clip. Now, let's go back to rocks. Keep silent. Jesus reigns. Now, uh, I'll tell you what, play the accompaniment now, Amy. And then we'll be on the home stretch here. Two, ready. Rocks keep silent. Jesus comes to set me free. Rocks keep silent. I'm going to shout the victory. Rocks keep silent. Jesus reigns in majesty. Ain't no rock going to shout for me. Yeah, and I'll give a better cutoff right there, but that's the right idea. And then we get to do the same thing. Bottom of three, here comes the Lord as thou. So the girls get to do that. Then the guys get to do their thing. And back to the, if the people don't shout. Okay? The same idea. All right? So uh, next time we'll look farther down on there. And we last time we did this, we spent time on page five and that transition there. Okay? So bless you guys. Thank you, Philip, for getting that set up to, to exit. Um, thank you, team. Appreciate you guys. Um, we'll keep rehearsing. Um, the, the plan is to keep rehearsing here, so we'll see you back next week. Uh, look for a Zoom meeting just for a face-to-face -face hello. We haven't had one of those in several weeks, so we need to do that tomorrow night, 7 o'clock, um, 30 minutes if you can make it, uh, just to, to connect for a minute. Okay? So, again, thanks for your hard work on that. Um, 
you're probably paying attention to the emails I hope that pastor sent. The plan right now is to go back into two services for just a short season, hopefully, 8.30, 10.30. Um, I'm really sad that we can't start with choir right off the bat, but again, it's, it's not wise at the moment just yet. And so pray for wisdom. Pray for wisdom for us, for me, as we make those determinations. And please take care of yourself, folks. Um, yeah, uh, wear a mask. The mask is not always for you. It's for other people. And by the way, all the stuff I'm seeing, a cough, a sneeze, those are deadly. So that's why you wear a mask or you learn how to do a really good <clears throat> cough. Pull that elbow in and use your sleeve, okay? Sacrifice your sleeve and save the planet. Okay, so just a little public service announcement, no extra charge. <laughs> I love you guys. I so miss you. Ugh, I'm, I'm kind of going nuts to that end. And uh, can't wait to see you. I realize that some of you won't be able to join us right back initially um, because it's not good for your health to do so. So please uh, pray, listen to the Lord, uh, make good decisions about that. But uh, anyway, look forward to seeing you soon. Let me pray and then we'll scoot. Lord, thank you for this time you've given us, for this opportunity to sing for you in this brief rehearsal. Uh, I do look forward to when we can gather together as a, as a church family and uh, in particular, Lord, as a choir family and to sing your praises together. Uh, keep us safe, keep us well, help us make good choices and decisions about uh, how much we're out in public and, and, the ways, and the ways that we do that to protect ourselves, our families, and then other people uh, who are uh, at risk. We love you and pray in Christ. Amen. Love you guys. Have a good night.